good morning guys welcome back here on the channel it's a beautiful morning here in Mora yesterday we did our first day on the ACT the adventure country track yesterday I always said trail I don't know why I said trail but anyways we're leaving Mora now for our second day on the ACT it said on the website that this time it's going to be the longest of the sections and yeah it's 260 kilometers and it has about 40 percent off-road which is cool that is exactly i think the amount of off-road that i would like today we started early it's nine and it's chilly it is five degrees but i wanted to start early to have enough time, you know, to film, stop to see cool things because that's what it's all about, right? Let's do this! Guys, this is the Algueva Dam. From what I heard, it's the biggest dam and artificial lake in Western Europe. The water comes from the Guadiana River. Yeah, and it's really, it's massive, really. Very cool. Our first sight here on the day two of the ACT. Very cool, go check it out. Let's get back on the road. Guys, the noise is back. Shit. Can you hear that? Whoa. That really sounds bad. Guys, what is this? Uh, shit, hey. Man. Now, well, what can we do? Nothing, I'd say. It's just there now. Alright guys, let's keep going for now. I mean... If it stays now... It would actually be kind of good. Because... Then I can have somebody look into it you know if it's not there uh, oh yeah. Let, let's get going for a bit and just see oh Honda what are you doing it is a bit slimy Uh, yeah, yeah. Muddy, muddy, muddy. Ah, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful here. Guys, today the noise didn't go away anymore. So I'm now in Portel and I found a, a shop. So I'm just gonna drive by and see if they know. They, they should know. I mean, I have no idea about engines, you know? Maybe it's the valves, maybe it's the camshaft. I don't know. 
just sounds bad. And just want to have somebody look over it. Is it here? Hi. Hello. Do you speak English? No. Problem. Oh. Clack, 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 clack. Ventile? Ah, Evora, shop, repair. Ah. Devagar, no? No, 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 Tranquilo? Ja. Evora. Evora. Ja. Honda. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, obrigado. Ciao. Okay, guys. He said it might be the valve. But for some reason he didn't want to help me. Or he couldn't. Or I think uh, he said something like they have the right tools in uh, Evora. I think they have to adjust the valves. And they have the right tools, the measuring tools, I guess. It's a Honda shop. And he gave me the address and he said, slowly, uh, we should be fine. Okay, let's go there. Okay guys, in Evora now. Okay. Honda. Honda, here we go. Good old Honda shop. Okay, let's see. Hello? Can I help you? Yeah, I have a problem with my motorbike. Which one? Um, there's a clacking noise in the engine. You have to, do you have to, um, the bottle? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, but my inner separation is going to be better than almost. Yeah, but I think it's going to be positive. Ah, after lunch. Okay, guys. They can help me, they also say. It's the boss. They're taking their lunch breaks seriously here in Portugal. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're having lunch soon. Uh, so I have to come back at uh, 2.30, which is in uh, yeah three hours. So we have three hours to kill now. some time to answer all your YouTube comments. We are hitting the 10,000 subscribers soon. I guess when you see the video it's going to be way more already. It's crazy. What What's happening the last two weeks is just insane. Thanks for that, guys.
I'm trying to answer all your comments, even though it's a ridiculous amount. <sighs> yeah, this day turned out a lot different than I thought. I thought we were going down the trails, but yeah, now we're here. Also cool, but I just don't really know how the day will end now. If we're staying here tonight or... I don't know how long they will take to fix the valves. And, but yeah, it wouldn't have been much fun riding, continuing on the trail with that noise and not knowing what it is exactly. And It's 2.30 now. Let's go in the shop. See you there. Hey. The bike has to be cold. You yeah, yeah, yeah. Lunch I, for I, here. I understand. Yeah, I'll, I'll just. Guys, you heard the woman. The bike has to be cold. Look at those bikes here. That one is so cool. If I had to choose one bike other than the Honda, it would be the Africa Twin, for sure. So her boss just came and he was like all mad because he said that they are not going to make it today. So I have to get something to stay here for sure, but all my stuff on the bike. So I need to get it done today. So I just booked the room for tonight, 28 euro. It's okay, right here in the center of Evora. I have to get all my stuff there then later. Just in case they won't get it done today. Anyways. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Sorry. Uh, I I was worried that was gonna happen. Now it is gone, and I don't know what's going on. Now I booked. The <laughs> ah shit. <laughs> Knew that was gonna happen. Really. And you could literally see, even though I didn't understand a word he was saying, I knew he just didn't want to do it. They, I mean, I hate that when there's a problem and then it just, it's gone now. Okay, cool. Still don't know what it is and tomorrow is going to happen again. Oh man. No, I don't know what the noise is. Sure, now it's gone. Now it sounds normal. So what, next time she's hot and it's gonna happen again. I don't know what it is really. Anyways guys, I'll see you at the hotel that I now booked in Evora for no reason. Ah, the day is, the day is over anyways. The day is over anyways. guys they now won't have a fucking covid test 
that cost me 25 euro now otherwise they won't let me stay and I can't cancel the booking anymore because of course it was the last minute and oh man what a day it's annoying Okay guys, so that was very unpleasant again, so but at least it was only 15 euros Not 25 like the last time So and we're in Right at the plaza here, so I'll get a coffee I'll just wait the 15 minutes What a day guys really Ridiculous, really. All right, now we can at least check into the hotel. All right, friends, I'm at the hotel now. Pretty simple, but not too bad. And yeah, COVID test again, Ugh, 15 euro. Annoying. The whole waiting, I mean, it wasn't useless because I saw the city and it's a beautiful city and it was cool. I was in the museum, but uh, I didn't want to, it was not the plan of the day, but I, I guess that's how it is. And yeah, they, I, I literally could see how the head mechanic didn't want to help me. Like he was like, and he hurt the bike at the start and then, yeah, of course it was gone. There was just a, a slight ticking that wasn't like it usually is, like to my ears. And, but yeah, he, he heard it before and yeah but he didn't want to look into it and yeah tomorrow i don't know what to do i don't know what to do i will just yeah i'll just keep going and if it comes again let's see let's see all right guys thanks for tuning in and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you tomorrow cheers